Hey, I'm Michael Goodlin from OrchestraXGroups.com and host of the Per Service Podcast. Today we're going to talk about vibrato, but you don't need to hear it from me. Who you need to hear it from is all the violin teachers. There are three types of vibrato, and they are from biggest to smallest, arm vibrato, wrist vibrato, and finger vibrato. But let's keep things in mind that since your finger is the only part of your body that touches the string, all vibrato is essentially finger vibrato. Tension is the nemesis of a good vibrato. So we want to just start by loosening everything up. No tension in your jaw, just loosen it up. No tension in our shoulders, just relax. Take a deep breath and exhale. Now we're ready to begin. I'm gonna tell you a story about me and my friend Amy. Would you like to hear it? Great. One day I was walking across the street and I saw my friend Amy in her house and I waved at her in the window. Can you wave just like this? Just wave, just your wrist. Say hello, hello Amy. But she didn't see me. And so I walked up to her door and I knocked on her door. I knocked one, she didn't answer. One, two, she still didn't hear me. One, two, three, still nothing. One, two, three, four, and I kept going and kept going. One, two, three, four, five, until finally she answered the door and I said, Amy, it's so good to see you. Would you like to go to the park and slide on the slides and swing on the swings? And she said, yes, let's go. We went to the slide. We climbed up the slides and our knees were bent and our fingers were bent too. Our knees were bent as we climbed up the slide and then we slid down and we straightened our legs and our fingers too and we straightened them out as we slid down and then we did it again. We climbed up the ladder, up, up, up to the, as high as we could go and then we slid down. It was so much fun. We climbed up and we slid down. We climbed up and we slid down, we climbed up and slid down, and you get the idea. And then all of that sliding and climbing up got us really tired. And so we said, Amy, let's go back to my house. And we just rocked on this big rocking chair. We just rocked back and forth and back and forth and back and forth, just like that. And it was very similar to the slide. We climbed back and forth and back and forth. And we could do it on any finger we wanted, too. We could do it on the second finger, or first finger, or fourth finger. You can do it on any finger you want. And that's the story of me and my friend Amy. I'm so glad you came to exercise today. Are you ready to do this? I'm ready. What we're gonna do, I've got the beat at 60. We're just gonna do what I do. You put your second finger on top of the violin, and we're just gonna slide it back with the beat. Ready? Down and back. Down and back. That's right, just keep it going just on top of the fingerboard. Yeah, give me two more. Now we're gonna double it. Ready, here we go. Up, down, back, forth. Here we go. You can do this. All right. You think you can do triplets? Give me two more. One, two, two. Here we go. And Think we can go to 16th notes? Yeah, let's do it. And two, two. That's it. You can do this on any finger all day long. Let's do it. Let's keep it going. All vibrato starts with a relaxed and flexible fingertip. So I want us to take a big inhale. And as we exhale, I want you to wiggle the fingers on your left hand and get each one of these joints moving. Are you ready? Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, and exhale. No tension whatsoever. We just wiggle each of these joints. Good. Did you feel that? The fingers must be like the piston in your automobile. The fingers explode up to the pitch and then bounce back automatically. 
you only think about the upwards motion of the fingers. Up, 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 up. Oui? C'est bon. All right, the second exercise is a lot like the first one. Let's get ready to dig deeper. I want you to give me that third finger on the A string. We're gonna play a D, and we're just gonna go up and down. Up and down, let's play, here we go. Can you give me two notes per beat? Yeah. Can you give me three notes per beat? Here we go. Can you give me four notes per beat? Here we go, ready and go. Um. How about six? How about eight? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Let's exercise. There are two variables that create your vibrato. There is vibrato speed, un vibrato width. And therefore, that creates four categories of vibrato. There is fast and narrow. Fast and wide. Slow and narrow. And slow and wide. All you gotta do is just start slow and gradually get faster until you got it. Cause you either got it or you don't got it. If your violin is shaking too much while you play, it's probably because you are squeezing the neck of your violin too much. It's like trying to drive an automobile with the emergency brake on. So just relax, let go of the sum. You don't need it. Just relax, enjoy yourself and your violin. All right, so I've got Pierre here, and we're gonna do an exercise where I do the wiggling of your fingers for you. What I need you to do is lean your scroll into, into my shoulder. Good, not so hard. Okay, okay, okay. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hold your third finger down, and then I, what I'm gonna do is wiggle your finger for you. I just need you to relax. Just relax your shoulder, relax your head, just relax everything. Good, okay, and now I'm gonna wiggle. Do you feel? There, so relaxed he went to sleep. Look at that. All right, I need you to play a nice D for me. We're gonna play on the, on, on, on the A string, on the A string. Yeah, do you feel that? Do you feel that? Good. Beautiful. We're nice and relaxed. Good. All right, for this exercise, we're gonna put our scroll against the wall. You can put a cloth or something against your scroll so you don't damage it and we're gonna let go of our thumb. Just let go of that thumb. You don't need that thumb. And we're just gonna go back, and up, and back, and up, 
and give me two, and back, and back, and boo. Give me three, da tu ga bu ba bu da tu da tu. Give me four, ti ga da gu da gu da. That's it. You're doing it. Give me four, and three, and two, and one. Give me six. That's right. Give me eight and all the time. You don't need your thumb at all. Just let go of that thumb. Your thumb isn't helping you do vibrato. That's right. I'm so glad you came to exercise. Your vibrato must not stop in between these notes. Why you have these dead notes? You must sing every note, period. No, no, no. Your vibrato sounds like you're strangling an anemic goat or something. Not... Just, I mean, I'm, I'm exaggerating, all right? I'm exaggerating. Just, but just play it like how I play it. practicing is. You think practicing for 60 seconds and putting it on Insta or whatever means you practiced so you can get subscribers and likes? When I was your age at conservatoire, I practiced 17 hours every day and nobody liked it. <laughs> <laughs> 